Best espresso machines. Delani EC15515. I like the Delani. It's an approachable and classical brand. It's many people's first touch point with espresso. I got the previous version of this machine many years ago, when I was less of a coffee snob than I am today. Still, I think back on the machine with fondness. It definitely punches above its weight. The espresso has a decent crema, and the machine heats up in a hurry. The steamer isn't the best one around, but nobody expects it to be. It will be more than fine for a cappuccino with some big airy foam, but not suitable for lat art. Since this machine comes with a pressurized basket, you can get shots with crema very easily. The downside is that the shots will not be authentic. But many people don't know the difference or don't care. You can also use yeast pods with this machine, which is actually a really good and convenient way to make espresso if you don't have any barista skills. If you're looking for something that's super, super cheap, but still a decent home espresso maker with a portafilter and 15 bars of pressure, this is one of your best bets. Breville BES 920XL. Italians have dominated espresso for years. This has been both good and bad for us consumers. Good because they make beautiful machines that can brew tasty coffee, but bad because they tend to be conservative tech-wise. Breville is an Australian brand that doesn't mind doing things a bit differently and that has paid off. I don't think I'll offend anyone by saying that they have been the most innovative company when it comes to domestic espresso machines in recent years. The dual boiler is the current top-of-the-line machine. It's meant for people who want barista-level espresso and lats. You can adjust and control almost every little detail with this machine. You have an adjustable PID thermometer, so you can nail the exact right temperature for any bean you throw at it. As the name indicates this machine also has two boilers, which is just going to make your life a hundred times more easy when it comes to making milk-based coffee. Of course, a single boiler will work, but it's just a massive headache to wait for the boiler to reach steaming or drop back to brew temp. This is especially the case if you're making more drinks back to back. The main downside with Breville is that you don't get quite the same heritage looks as you do with the Italian E61 machines, however, the espresso will taste better and be more consistent. Rancilio Silvia. Rancilio Silvia is often called Ms. Silvia among the many loyal long term users. That is because she's a little bit like a strong willed Italian lady. Treat her with respect, and she'll reward you with kindness as well as thick and textured espresso shots. However, if you're more lackadaisical in your approach to the art of making cappuccino and espresso your results are going to be sub-par. That being said, Rancilio Silvia is the gold standard when it comes to home espresso makers, and it has been this way for more than two decades now. This machine is a stainless steel trooper, it has an industrial-sized 58mm portafilter and a vintage Italian look. If you want to get serious about making classic Italian espresso or cappuccinos at home, this is a great option. The main downside is that it doesn't have a built-in PID thermometer like some of its competitors. It's more expensive than the similar Gaggia Classic, but for the extra cash you do get a bigger machine with more room to work on the drip tray more steam power and a bigger boiler. In many ways they are similar machines, but Sylvia should be your choice if you're mainly planning to make milk-based drinks. Gaggia RI9380. The Gaggia Classic Pro is one of the most popular entry-level espresso machines. It's sturdy, compact, and Italian, and also comes with a real commercial-sized portafilter. In many ways, it's similar to its long-term rival, the Rancilio Silvia. The Gaggia Classic is more affordable than Miss Silvia, and if you ask me, it's a more attractive option after its recent redesign. The Gaggia Classic underwent a redesign last year and has improved in a bunch of ways while retaining an attractive price. The new colorways, a better steam wand, and an improved solenoid valve are welcome additions. This device is known for making great espresso shots, but also for requiring a bit of modding, if you want the best results. Many users end up adjusting the OPV to get to 9 bars, and some also install a PID thermometer 
to get better temperature stability. An espresso machine reviews it's usually praised for having the best build quality among the budget options, and I have to agree. This model can easily last for a decade if you take good care of it. Personally, I'd prefer the Breville Bambino Plus as my first espresso maker, but if you're willing to modify the Gaggia and investing in some additional espresso accessories, the old-school Italian still has a lot going for it. Breville Bambino Plus The Bambino Plus from Breville is my top pick for the burgeoning, yet budget-constrained, barista. I have had some epic shots from this espresso maker. It's a small machine that can look a little bit innocent and vanilla at first glance. But don't be fooled. A lot of thought has gone into the functionality and features of the Bambino Plus. Compared to its more old-school Italian rivals it's a lot easier to use and more reliable straight out of the box. It has a built-in PID thermometer, pre-infusion, and brews at the correct 9 bars instead of 15, which is way too much. The PID ensures that the temperature is correct when pulling shots or steaming. Don't underestimate how nice this feature is in daily life. It means that there is no need for temperature surfing, which is mandatory on all the Italian single boilers. Pre-infusion is also worth highlighting. This is a feature that is normally only available on much more expensive machines. The main downside to the Bambino is that it only comes with a pressurized basket, so you have to invest in a real espresso basket if you want to get the best out of the machine. However, a single wall basket is cheap, so it's not a big expense that should deter you. Overall, this machine is just a great value for the money. You'll be able to make good espresso and lats with a few hours of practice. Delani ESAM 3500. N. There is a wide range of espresso machines, and there's the Delani SM3500. If you are in search for the best espresso machine for making your favorite lat, cappuccino, and espresso, this particular model will satisfy your needs. The Magnifica is relatively top in its class and is such a great addition to your kitchen appliances. It is larger compared to its some of its contenders and containers a larger water capacity and coffee beans. One of the best things that will take your breath away about the ESAM 3500 and is that it comes with a compact brewing system and a removable water container. This comes in handy when it comes to cleaning and maintenance. The best coffee maker is not just about brewing a variety of coffee drinks. It has to also have the capability of making different cup amounts and sizes. With the featured adjustable coffee sprouts, you can easily make demitasse, espresso among others. Compared to some machines with the ESAM 3500, and you will not have to wait for long periods to get the optimal temperature for your beverage. In fact, the instant reheat function come in handy to help maintain a consistent temperature at all times. The programmable menu setting will help you in ways such as adjusting water harness, controlling temperature and setting time. Although the most popular setting amongst the programmable options is the ability to control the flavor or strength of your espresso. This lets you choose from mild, strong, regular and extra mild coffee. You can also fine-tune your coffee with an integrated burr grinder. And if you want the best quality espresso, you will have to look fresh, natural ground coffee beans. Aside from that, you will require the beans to brew system of the ESAM 3500 and to brew espresso in its best aroma. All of these features combine to make sure you get the best cup of espresso possible. Gaggia Brera. What other espresso can possibly beat out the Gaggia Brera when it comes to making quality espresso? I bet nothing comes close. This machine is a clear definition of quality, convenience and looks. Well, speaking of looks, you are sure to get amazed by its compact design that makes it fit in any of your kitchen space easily. You will enjoy every minute of your time while brewing with the Gaggia 59100 Brera. When it comes to making great tasting drinks, the included stainless boiler and 15 bar pump work their best to ensure an optimal temperature ideal for the task. Besides, regardless of your cup size, big, medium or small, the 599,100 will accommodate it. This is made possible by the telescopic coffee dispenser lets you change the height to perfectly hold the mug of your choice. 
All components of this unit that are used for daily operations, water tank, grounds disposal, drip coffee beans and drip tray, can be easily accessed from the front of the machine. Not only does this make it easy to clean, but also to maintain. If there is one feature that will mesmerize you, is the intuitive user-friendly control panel that integrates push-button controls, a large display as well as a quick reference with dedicated icons for the steaming, grinding and brewing functions. Adjusting the level of the brew spout is very simple. All you have to do is either pull up or down action. While you have to pour your espresso from a sizable cup that fits well under the portofino and lose all your espresso flavorful crema, with the Gaggia Brera it's quite different. You can use any of your assorted cups and get them to fit well with just a simple pull to change the height of dispensing spout. Delani ESAM 3300. You will not get an espresso machine that is a combination of value, power, ability and features other than the Delani ESAM 3300. Despite its small design, the Magnifica is very impressive that it has widely scored highest, taking up the top rank amongst the top-end super-automatic machines. You will appreciate all the guesswork this maker eliminates to deliver the best delicious shot. Yet another patented feature is the cappuccino system of the Delani that basically lets you brew cappuccino for your friends and family instantly. This feature also offers you a complete 180-degree rotation, and in turn allowing your milk to pour directly into containers of different sizes. If you want consistency in your espresso, there is a direct brewing system to help you achieve that. What's more is that you can also adjust the fitness of your coffee beans easily, owing this to the inbuilt, high-quality, low-pitch burr grinder. This grinders will work with the touch of a button to provide the same exact amount of your shot and its strength. If you like, you can also set the new and exciting twists that hit all off your adventurous taste buds at a go. Regardless of whichever option you take, you will minimize some of the tedious work such as refilling the 60-ounce water tank and cleaning the machine. Speaking of cleaning, the ESAM 3300 is self-cleaning and also features a declassification indicator. For an occasional treat, the ESAM 3300 allows you to produce a variety of espresso-based drinks starting from lats and cappuccinos to coffee and other frothy specialties. To spice it up, you get the most aromatic and flavorful espresso when you use beans to brew system. The stainless steel boilers will aid in heat distribution. This reduces time wasted to make a perfect tasty shot. Breathe 800 ESXL. Have you had the misfortune of having to wait for a coffee maker to cool down to pull a shot? If you have, then you will be fascinated by the self-purge function integrated in the Breathe 800 ESXL. With this features, you can be sure to get your shot in just a few seconds. The idea behind this is that it automatically adjusts temperatures back to optimal brewing temperatures after use of the steaming wand. Just like most espresso machines, this one also features a thermoblock heating system that lets you make chocolate, tea, and coffee efficiently and easily. The heating system comes in handy with the 15-bar prime pressure pump that releases three bursts of hot water to moisten your ground coffee. This results in extracts that are full or aroma and flavor. And of course, you can brew much more than just the espresso. The frothing wand is the feature that allows you to make cappuccinos and lats anytime you like. Besides that, you can enjoy up to three espresso variants, not including all that your imagination can conjure up. Built to last, this maker is made of stainless steel. I must admit that this is a great step up from the low-priced espresso machines in its class. The die-cast steel exterior also gives it an attractive professional look that blends in perfectly with your kitchen or cafe decor. It is worth mentioning that the triple priming espresso machine brews rich, thick brown cream that is sure to satisfy espresso lovers. Capresso EC100. When the Capresso EC100 is removed from the box, the first thing that will catch your attention is its stainless steel based design. Not only does it add a bold statement to it, but it is also easy to clean. Designed by the Capresso, best known for their high-quality products, the Capresso EC100 is over the edge with its competitors due to its intellectual functions such as the LED monitor. The Capresso EC1002 integrates a thermoblock heating system lined with stainless steel. 
With this feature, you are capable of enjoying of piping hot coffee full of authentic flavors and aromas that are extracted from the coffee beans. Speaking of extraction, the none other than the 15 bar pump is responsible for this. Also, if you like, there is an option of either using pre-packaged espresso coffee pods or your own finely ground coffee to produce a delicious cup of espresso. Doesn't it feel good to have a coffee machine that allows you to enjoy a cup of cappuccino or latte at the comfort of your home? Well, the Capresso EC1002 makes this possible by integrating a dual frothier. What does this mean? It means that with separate frothing positions for frothed milk and steamed milk you can make cappuccino and latter respectively. With the frothing sleeve, you can swirl hot air and steam into your milk to make a rich foamy layer at the top of your cappuccino. While brewing lats, you just remove the frothing sleeve and make use of the underlying steam tubes that inject hot steam into your milk to produce the best tasting latter. Although the short length of the electrical cord may come out as one of the Capresso EC1002 shortcomings, it is ideal for keeping kids out of the machine's reach as well as preventing lots of mess on your kitchen countertops. Moreover, with the included indicator lights, you can tell if your machine is on or off.